everybody. Welcome back. Of course, I'm back with my friend Mary. Say hi, Mary. Hey, everybody. So today, we decided that we wanted to do an encore for Mary because her coming on the channel was just so well received. Yay! Yay! She really just made everybody want to watch. I think our chemistry is great and we decided to have her come back and we're doing a seafood boil. And I'm so excited because I've never done a seafood boil before. Mary has, so mm -hmm. I, I- had to wear my big t-shirt today, you know. And I want, yeah, we're gonna get pretty messy. We both have uh, us a little- I don't even know towel. what, little towels <laughs> yeah. for, all, for all the juices. So <laughs> yeah, we're doing a lobster tail seafood boil. Let's pick up our lobsters because we have to do thumbnails. So. So here we are doing our, and I don't know if we want to maybe grab one and something like this. Okay. Oh, I'm a muffin. <laughs> okay. So I guess, well, I'm excited because I've never done a seafood boil, as I mentioned, and I wanted to for a while. And um, it's probably been well over a year that I wanted to do a seafood boil, but I'm not really, I've not really cooked a lot of seafood other than fish. You know, I do a mean beer batter and I can do these shrimp. I can fry them up or saute them for you, but that's about it. But anyway, let's say grace. Would you like to lead us this time? I'm not ready. Okay. She's you shy, not in a million years. <laughs> when it comes to praying, I'm just a point, mom. Sorry. Okay. Well, I'll okay. just be ready next time. Next time. Okay. Dear Lord, we thank you for food in a world where people hunger. We thank you for friends in a world where people walk alone. We thank you for this meal in the name of your son, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Okay. So, uh. Well, let's, let me start by saying that uh, Mary made the sauce. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. She made the sauce and she made... Uh... It's like a rendition of Bloves. He loves. Okay. I, I say Bloves. Why, why do we say that? <laughs> and okay. Because they don't put a space between B and love. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to do this first. So... Mary did the cooking and I did the prep because I'm familiar with the prep because I've seen it done a million times, but I've not really cooked them. Oh. Mm. <laughs> oh, oh, you, you, you got to do Already. Uh -huh. mm. okay. Isn't that soft, girl? Mm -hmm. Really lemony, really juicy. Mm -hmm. so. Oh my, that's big. <clears throat> you know, I've never had a lobster tail this big. Close up uh, with Mary sauce. I'm glad I wore a big t shirt today, too. Mm. <laughs> wow, this sauce is so good. This sauce came out so good. Mm. Mm -hmm. This should be my own, my own trademark. It's like my own hint. You know, that's that's all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Let's see how it is with them. I'll be right back. We Ready? forgot the potatoes. <laughs> Dang, we did. Should I stop mm -hmm. eating? Mm -mm. Still eating. Okay. <laughs> And okay. I'm back with the potatoes. We forgot to put the potatoes on. 
Oh, I don't want to make them steamy. The uh, a steamy never, they never. Well, hurt you nobody. go ahead and grab yours. Put these over here. Oh, it is hot though. It's a little burning. Mm hmm. You put them aside. Oh, you want me to add more? All right. Okay, I got it. I got it. Mm. Mm. So today, oh my goodness, we had a department meeting today. It was mad long. Yeah, you know how sometimes managers, they overextend their stay? She was talking forever. Jesus. Oh, no. You know how I said forever, ever? Well, like that. Um, but it, was never, it never stopped. Mm. Was she um, from a different location? I don't know. She's used to us. <laughs> but she doesn't work at that office. Well, she does. Mm. She just knows how to overextend her stay. Mm -hmm. I know, it's a mess. Try these eggs too. Where did I put my child? Did you say your child? My child. Oh. Mm. Here it is. Whoop, here it is. <laughs> oh, these are crunchy. Mm. <laughs> mm hmm. Um, we have jumbo shrimp, and we have the large shrimp, with um, dewy sauces, right? Mm-hmm. Um, and cornbread. <laughs> cornbread. Glad I wore my big t-shirt today. I wore the right color too. Matches the sauce. Mm-hmm. Mm. Is that working there good? Oh. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's corn is good. I didn't think it was going to be so sweet. <clears throat> Especially for this time of year, right? Mm-hmm. I heard it's not corn season. I didn't know until today. I'm like, oh. So much lifted up in my life, Jesus. Mm -hmm. I splashed myself. <clears throat> I splashed myself on the eyebrow with some of the sauce. No, oh, don't burn yourself. It's not spicy. I like mm -hmm. it. I feel so blessed. It's like I'm eating like a king. I'm gonna nail for king. Yeah, this is a big treat. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Now, this is how you want your first time eating a seafood boil. <laughs> Yes, I'll just take this whole thing and just... You might as well. Let's see. Spicy. Crunchy. Let's see what I need to go. Oh, sucker. Sucker. <laughs> you know where I heard that from? Sookie. 
that I even where I heard, first heard it from, True Blood. That's what William would always call that that other blonde girl. Have you ever seen True Blood? Mm-mm. It's a good show. It's a show? Yeah, do you like vampire shows, though? Mm-mm. I'll talk about it. <laughs> Mm -hmm. That kind of stuff. Mm -mm. <laughs> That's the devil stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mess around with that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh no. See, I don't think it's that bad. I like that stuff, that vampire stuff. Like this, ready? <laughs> <laughs> what is it, ASMR? <laughs> That's a lot of crunchy stuff. Mm -hmm. You know how you start slowing down? Mm -hmm. Oh man. Not a lot of potatoes. Jeez. I'm done with it. Oh, that's why you haven't eaten as many of your shrimp. <laughs> I don't know if I can finish that. I'll finish mine. Oh my. <clears throat> we can't be now here. <laughs> mm. Now you ain't supposed to like vegetables as much as I just like that corn. That corn is really good. Mm -hmm. That corn is really good. I'm good. Broccoli is too. Mm -hmm. Look how fresh that broccoli is. Just the right amount of spice. Where, the sauce? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. where I'm not like running for the water. Matter of fact, I haven't picked up the water yet. I'm kind of a lightweight when it comes to the spiciness. Mm -hmm. It's just uh, it's so much butter. Ooh, that ain't a bad thing, y'all. Mm. I gotta figure out how to. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Put potatoes out of there. Put this in there. Oh, you got your potatoes soaking in there, huh? Look for them, yeah. Okay, in there. We could dump these in there. Mm. No? What's that? You know, we could dump the, the vegetables in that silver bowl. Oh! That's what you were talking about. Mm -hmm. What we still got. I'm gonna put these out. Mm. Excuse me. And I gotta take like deep breaths in the middle of this. Mm. Man, this is my second time doing this and I'm already, I feel like I'm a champion, but I'm over here still deep breathing. Ooh, I'm trying one of these muffins. crazy because every time you eat <clears throat> finish something you don't know which to eat next. I'm trying one of your eggs yet. Mm -hmm. The eggs is good. They look good, especially with the sauce. Mm -hmm. I love this. I love this cornbread. What you put in here? I put uh corn. <laughs> Oh, um, I put yeah. corn in it. Um, oh, she's in it now. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, I put garlic and onion. Mm -hmm. And um, 
a little oregano in there. Mm. I'm slowing down. Ooh. We still got like <laughs> not even half of this plate to go. Mm. I truly feel blessed. Mm -mm. As you are. Mm -hmm. As I am. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. I know. <laughs> I'm blessed to have the kind of problems we have. I mean, that paper is basically done. Mm -hmm. And it didn't allow me to put out a good quality video on Sunday. And that upset me. Mm. Um, because I had to <clears throat> put my schoolwork first. But... It worked out. I waited for this all day. Me too. Mm. All day. You know how you get so excited? Then there there it goes. You get all excited for the food. And then you can't even eat much as you thought. Well, that's not the case with me today. <laughs> Okay, prepared. Mm -hmm. Wow. I know. In a good way. I know. It's like, man, I don't, we didn't even make a dent. <laughs> man, we didn't even make a dent. I'm almost done. Just lock the tail here. I'm going to finish this up. Mm-mm-mm. How you feeling? How you doing over there? Uh, I'm gonna take it a little slower than I was, but I'm gonna keep eating. Slow motion. You know, I can't remember the last time I ate bell peppers like this. You know, eating them in this way. And this bell pepper tastes really good. I mean, it tastes like, like it's got a little bit of a tang to it. Like a, just a slight peppery tang to it. Can you woo, woo, woo? Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> I tried. It was the best I got. Was my attempt good enough? Mm -hmm. but I can try it again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. I'm glad I wore my stretchy pants too. Oh my god. I wore my stretchy pants. Thick shirt. That was all good points. Because I would have been stuck. Believe it or not. I'm in the same boat. I got pants on with an elastic waist. Mm. You look. It tastes like a tomato to me though. I'm slowing down. Slowing down. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. Just a little bit? Just a little bit, you think? I think a lot. Mm. Mm. I'm not gonna eat that. I'm gonna have to eat a piece of cake though. It's like cake, baby, cake, 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 cake. That's what they tell me in the streets, you know? 
They got that cake, 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 cake. <laughs> Here go that cake, 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 cake. I'm telling you, that's what, they, that's what, they tell, that's what they're going to be telling me. Not really. That's what I tell myself, though. That's what's most important. The self-love. If you didn't know, you know now. Well, I guess we all got to tell ourselves something, man. One way or the other. I mean, I gotta sleep one way or another, right? Ooh. Mm -hmm. What do I attack next mm -hmm. that I can actually handle? This stem. <laughs> On the broccoli stem. Dun dun dun. <laughs> This is good. Probably stem. Where did the napkin come out? <coughs> oh, you can't hang? I mean, I can, but dang. Mm -hmm. Sticking it out. What? I mean, Mm. I think this looks good. I I think this is the first time that I like this is andouille sausage. And you know, this is a good sausage. I don't think I ever paid attention to it until now. Is what's the is there like why is it called andouille? Or spicy? Well, we'll have to find that out. That'll be our task and anybody who is watching or a subscriber if you know comment well you're gonna know now because i'm gonna probably post it on the screen that's it so um it's on the screen now <laughs> Oh, that's a nice touch. Dang, man, you know. <laughs> I noticed that I got a lot of family in the South. Then. Shout out to the Bedgood family that lives in the South because a lot of them are on Facebook. And I'm finding out I got all these family members that I never met. Um, as I mentioned, my family is from Alabama, but they moved here about a year or two before I was born. Or, no, my father moved here when he was 22 to the north. My mother moved here when she was five years old. And all my sisters and brothers were born in the North. But we grew up with everybody in our family, aunts and uncles and grandmother and grandfather. All of them are from Alabama. I've only been there one time since I was a kid, but shout out to my family in Alabama, the Bedgood family. And um, please subscribe to my channel. And um, I would find it a great privilege to visit some of your restaurants in Alabama, some of your favorite restaurants and and um, and get to meet you and post it on my channel. I would love to do that. So um, I haven't been to Alabama since I was 11 years old. I was in Mobile, Alabama, where my grandfather lived. And I visited him and I went fishing, you know, and um, it was it was a great time, you know, and um, so I hope that I'm living up to uh, the Southern expectation when I cook some of these Southern meals because they are important to me and they are a staple to uh, the Bedgood family. So here we are. Here we are. Yeah. I only got one aunt down south. She's in Tennessee. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's no. not too far. That, that's not I don't think it's too far. 
Lisa? I'm not sure about the geography, but I know my sister um, moved to Atlanta, and Atlanta, Georgia is not too far from Alabama either. Mm. It's like maybe an hour and a half, three hours. I don't know. It's Somebody right? comment and tell me because I don't know. <laughs> I'm not good at geography. I'm not good at that at all. Yeah, but you know what? It's like that. Like, unless you've been to a place, you really don't. You can't really, somebody can't just tell you the geography. You have to kind of be there to understand it. Because I was in uh, in Egypt. Oh. And um, Nubia was down the Nile River. And it was about an hour and a half away drive. Nubia. The town, there is a Nubia. Like they talk about the Nubian black Nubian kings and queens there's a city just um down the Nile from Egypt Cairo Egypt really yeah and it's all a, a lot of black people there are you surprised though? well you know like a lot of people they just hear about a lot of these terms and they don't realize that it's actually a place I mean correct me mm -hmm. if I'm wrong but Egypt is in the Middle East which is part of Africa is it not yeah. Well, yeah, of course. There's going to be a lot of... Well, it's North Africa. I wouldn't say the Middle East. I would say North Africa. But yeah, you would, it's still in Africa. It's like where mm -hmm. there's more sun. So there's going to be more melanated people there. Right? Well, yeah, but they have... It's very diverse. It's just very... It's a lot of different complexions. Okay. Yeah, a lot of different complexions. A lot of different looking people. Yeah, but it was like there's like a lot of black people like you surprised. No, I was actually talking in reference to the geographics oh, okay. because you hear about Nubia and some people don't know that Nubia is a place. Some people do, but it's like, yeah, it's like just a nearby uh, city. And, when I think of I, Nubia, though, I think of like a Nubian queen and that's always like in reference to like ancient, you right? know, but it's always yeah. in reference to like black melanin Royalty. women, right? Yeah, well, yeah, Nubia. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, I think of Nubian like a queen. I think mm -hmm. of a woman. Right? Am I wrong? Well, yeah, that's usually what it's... it's in, it, When we reference it here can in America, you, can you that's you say Nubian we, king, too? Is, guess, is Nubian a place? Oh, yeah. I was a person. I guess the people from there are Nubian. I don't know. No. But, um, anyway, know. the guy wasn't a prince. He mm -hmm. wasn't a king. He was... A cab driver and he would uh drive from nubia to cairo egypt to um you know drive cabs and i saw him and i said this brother from detroit who is this brother and, and i went up to him and i said what well, you american right he looked like his name was leroy and then he started talking and um he says, no, I'm from Nubia and everything. I said, really? I said, you look like some this guy I know named Leroy from Detroit. Get you out know? of here. And now, that's being stereotypical. Well, you know, um, it happens in Cuba. Yeah. I've been in the gym, and this is brother over there. I'm like, yo, brother, you know, hey. He, like, speaking like, you know, you know, Cuban and, you know, the Spanish, Spanish you know. He's, he's Afro-Latina. People be killing me when they're like, you, they speak that Puerto Rican. I'm like, I don't speak Puerto Rican. I speak Spanish. <laughs> right. He's good at that Cuban. They don't, they know Cuban. That's a dialect. It ain't a language. But, Come on, but anyway, me. he, I thought he was a, like, you know, a brother. He was Afro-Latina, which yeah. is still, uh, Afro-Latino is still a uh, brother, mm -hmm. you know. But in any way, you look at people and you don't expect Yes. them to speak broken English and have a, a strong one. Latin accent. So, <laughs> boy, oh boy, it went down. I've been through here. I think that's another corner. What the heck? Oh. I'm going to start eating dainty now. I'm like, I'm eating lemon <laughs> wedges now. Am I going to eat lemon wedges? I like lemon. No, they cleanse your palate, right? Okay. If you say you so. Make that, you, you I just like them. See, when I eat them, I make that mmm face like a can. Oh. 
I used to, as a kid, when I had my choice of fruits, I would want a, a lemon and, and peel it. And mm. My friend Jeff, he could eat them whole too like that. Like, you could just peel it and eat it like you just ate it. Oh, mm -hmm. oh no, I know he likes to do that. I like it. And then it, it peels just like an orange. Oh, but it's not mm. as sweet as an orange. Yeah, but I like it. And then you can put some salt on it. Was the other one a lime that you just ate? No, I just ate lemon? right there. I'm going to eat a lime next, but Ooh. it's you can put some salt on it. And eat it. Just like that. Oh, no, I'm scared of that. Mm -mm. I got that acid reflux. That acid reflux. It'll burn me. Mom, I don't get it from lemons, but I get it from a lot of pasta sauce. A lot of marineras and red bay sauce. Yeah. Yeah, with the tomato base. That's why it's good to put a little cream of some sort, like a cheese or anything with a cream base in it, Parmesan, anything to cut that acid. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Don't give up on me now. Mm -hmm. I can do it. Can't the heavy ones, the heavy the starches and the meat. Ooh, I'm gonna go for the vegetables and for the vegetables. Can't even eat one right now. How do you eat one of those? Mm -hmm. I feel like then, lemon. I'm eating a lime now. Oh no, that's scary. That's that's next level up. I can't do that yet. Right. Skin is not coming off as easy in there. Wait, Ooh, I'm gonna try it. I've never tried this before. Am I gonna cry? Am I gonna cry? No, I was. I had the dropsies. No, because am I gonna cry if I eat it like this? I don't know. I don't know. I'm you crying. only know. We'll, I guess we'll find out, huh? Okay. Dang. It's making it. A home lemon. Ooh. Ooh, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna just go like this. Oh, this is even better. Because it's mild. Oh! How you do that? Ooh! <laughs> oh, Lord! Oh! I don't know about that. You can't eat lemon? Huh? How people eat lemons like that? Oh my god. Oh lord. Ooh. Love it. Mm. Especially after eating that egg. Oh my goodness. And it was like a sweet lemon too, but it still was like I can't eat lemons like that. Ooh. I'm gonna be twitch. What's that? And now you finish with a... Wow. A shrimp. Is that like um you know you like you chase a shot with juice? So you chase a lemon with a shrimp? It um I guess you're right. It does clear your palate. Yeah. My palate feels cleared. <laughs> it does. Ooh. Make you go one more again. Make you can go one more again. You know what that is? No. One more again? No, what is that? What is that? <laughs> what is that? Make you come. Make you go one more again. One more game. Another time. Okay. I can go another time. I can go one more game. That was not funny to me. Hmm? I, I, it, wasn't <laughs> it wasn't meant to be funny. It is what it is. 
five. We gonna cry. One more again. One more again. Like a phrase. One more again. One more again. Again and again and again. One more again and again and again. Mm -hmm. mm. One more again. Another time. Mm. You know, the lemon, the actual eating the lemon was not that great, but it really did clean your palate. It did. It, mm -hmm. like it, it took everything I had in my mouth and erased it. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. That's why I'm getting another a win. Because uh, I can go. Kinda yeah. help. That kind of helped. It made me go one more game. Well, I'll... <laughs> okay, I get it now. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I get it now. Okay. But I don't know about that line though. I don't know about that line. That's a that's another dimension. Mm. Mm. I don't know about that line. That lemon was harsh. Mine was that lemon was really harsh. I don't know how you can do that. Mm. I don't know how you can do that. Well comment if you can eat lime whole like that. Oh or like slices. Even lemons too. The limes? Oh my goodness, I couldn't even, I can't imagine that. The limes, I feel, the limes are stronger than lemons, aren't they? Right? Well, after tonight, I would say that they're not. But I, I guess it depends on what lemon you have and what lime you have. <laughs> I don't know. We he losing his marbles today. We'll be cooking all day. He losing his marbles. <laughs> you know, I said, I said that to somebody today. That's the, that's the second time I used that phrase today. You lost your marbles. That's funny. Well, it's a weekend. We're entitled to lose them on the weekend because yeah. we don't need them. Well, how many but times? we need them back by Sunday evening. How many times do you think you say? To somebody who lost your marbles. You think you say that a lot? Have you lost your marbles? Not exactly the kind of terms I grew up hearing, but lost your marbles. What's the equivalent you to crazy? lost your marbles? You don't lost your mind? Yeah, yeah. But I feel like, mm -hmm. I, I don't know, I feel like marbles is like a nicer way of saying it. Mm -hmm. You know, so Same. you lost your mind. So, instead of asking somebody. Mm -hmm. You gonna win plum crazy. Yeah, like it's a nicer version of saying it. Marble. Have you lost your mind? No, I lost my marbles. Mm-hmm. No. I wonder how that even came about. Well, I heard of people finding their marbles again, but once you lose your mind, I don't think you're gonna get that back. Mm. That's a good point. I guess it's possible. That's a good point. You gonna lost your mind. You lose your marbles, you can say, have you found them? When I see you the next time, you can ask me, did, have I, did you find them? But if you yeah, lost your mind, I can't ask you one question. You lost your mind. I can't ask you whether you found your mind. You don't got it. You know, I didn't think about it that way. Think about that for next time. You lost your mind. And you needed to answer that question. <laughs> yeah, I did. Mm. Mm -mm. So it's more appropriate to say they lost their mind than lost their marbles. Yep. Oh, man. Oh. I think we're taking turns having stamina and then... I know. It's like you get the energy, then I get the oh. energy, then you get it back. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm going to like three and four of them already. Oh, yeah. You think one person could finish this by by themselves? Yeah. You think so? Nobody I know, but yeah. You could probably finish this by yourself. If I was given three hours. No, you got a few hours. I think you could do it. I like my first time having this and noticing that different foods get
give you a certain balance of everything that allows you to keep going back and forth. Yeah. Like, you know, this, like the meat and the seafood, they kind of balance each other out. And then the eggs are heavy, the potatoes are heavy, but like the vegetables like balances it out. It's not like I'm reaching for like the meat, then the vegetable and the meat, then the bread, then like they all balance each other out. That's kind of what's giving mm -hmm. me strength right now. Mm -hmm. And this water too. <laughs> I have a potato next. This cornbread is really, really good. I was very impressed. Mm. Yeah, I never thought about putting seasoning in there. Mm -hmm. But some I'm definitely going to do now. I like the idea of that. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Piling up. <laughs> I'm piling up. I'm piling up. How many? How many pounds? Do you think are there? Do you think How many what? Pounds of food do you think are there? Um, Let me go pick it up, lift it, and weigh it. What would you guess? <clears throat> Fifteen pounds. Fifteen? Oh, 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 no. I'm more than fifteen. Feels like it. Uh-huh. <clears throat> mm. mm. Okay. Mm. So hungry. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> well, what's kind of like? I was like, I was almost like, <laughs> it's like you were scared. You're like, oh, I don't know. I don't know if I can continue. When you eat certain things, you can eat more at that time, depending on what it is you're eating. Mm -hmm. See, this is uh all new to me because this I've never had anything set up like this. Mm. This is my first seafood boil. It's an exciting time for you, ain't it? Well, yeah. I have been studying them for quite some time, waiting for the moment to do it. <laughs> mm. I enjoyed uh, evading and Peeling the shrimp, I enjoyed eating the lobster, and it was fun. It was, it was fun. I'm glad I did it. I gl I'm glad I had a chance to do it like this. We went big. Um, I had a food baby, y'all. I'm mm. gonna name her Tina. <laughs> you had? Do you have a food baby yet? I had a food baby just now. Oh, okay. I know we talked about having elastic in our waistbands of our pants, right? Yeah. That's not working. Mm -hmm. I don't think I put enough. Well, if it was a button, that would... If it was a button, it would break. That's what that That's what that would be. It would uh, be screaming. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like, what's I, that going? Uh, and then you go, what? Oh, my and God. put somebody's eye out. Uh, hey, probably it probably kill somebody like a straight bullet. Oh my god, it's pressure. Ricochet off the wall. It's pressure. Like somebody's pressure. tooth out. Mm-hmm. You pressure on that button. That's not. Mm -hmm.
a financial liability wearing pants with buttons and it won't that be That sounds like a lawsuit. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Make sure nobody's around and it's a bystander too. Mm hmm. 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 If I eat one more muffin, I'm going to turn into a muffin. Hmm. I'm going to turn into a corn muffin. Cornbread. Ooh. You're going to eat your cornbread. Are you? Remember that movie? No. Life with Eddie Murphy and Martin Lawrence and. No. Who's that else in there? Bernie Mac was in there too. West oh. Peace. Mm hmm. <laughs> you gonna eat your cornbread? Yeah, he was so funny. Oh my god. You know what's funny though? What's that? Nothing, because this play is serious. Oh my god. Mm. Well, that's, that's about it for me for today. I'm gonna drink this water here. That's a, that's a wrap for me. That's a wrap. That's a wrap for me. You throwing in the towel? She throwing in her towel, her white towel. towel. Throw in your towel. Throwing it in. All yeah. right. Peace. And subscribe to my channel. Share this video, like this video, do this. Subscribe, don't forget, that tell them to subscribe. Okay, bye everybody. Have a nice day. <laughs>